It's November and we're still playing soccer. Drury hosting the first round of the GLVC tournament against Umsel. First half, Peter Higgins finds Michael Horton, who can't find the ball. More from Horton later. The Umsel women's soccer team showing their support. Stephen Connor's still going to make the save anyways, though, but the ladies like the effort. Missed opportunities for the Panthers in the first half. Still scoreless now in the second. In the scramble, senior Jake Allison makes the most of his opportunity and finds the net. But you see Allison slow down, there's a whistle. The DU bench is confused. A handball is the call on Allison, and looking at the replay, it seems like the ball may have deflected off of Umsel. So to overtime we go. The Dury crowd was ready, back to the action. Andrew Bordelon tries to shoot it over Umsel keeper Tim Borov's head, and he does, but it's also over the goal. So almost three hours after kickoff, Ryan Swan and the men head to sudden death double overtime. Oh, didn't I mention something about Michael Horton returning in this highlight? Post game, I am here with Micah Horton, scores the game winner. Micah, how do you feel? Uh, it feels great. Uh, it's always great to have a game winner, and uh, especially in overtime, you know, when uh, it's just everyone rushes the field and stuff. It's a great feeling. It wasn't just overtime, it was double overtime. How, how tired are you right now? <laughs> I'm exhausted. Uh, ready for a nap. Right. Congratulations, sir. Go celebrate. Thanks a lot. During University Men's Soccer plays for 106 minutes today. They win off a Micah Horton double overtime goal and they advance to the second round of the GLVC tournament.